Hello everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Welcome to this video. Today I want to show you how you can create TikTok pixel and install it on your website. This is a WordPress tutorial. If you have a WordPress website, this and you are running an e-commerce business on you are running a, an e-commerce website built on WooCommerce. This is a tutorial for you. If you are using Shopify, I'm going to create a video on how you can create TikTok pixel and integrate it with your Shopify website. But this is a WordPress tutorial website. So the first thing you need to do is to go to your ads manager, TikTok ads manager. This is TikTok ads manager. You create TikTok ads manager is just like the way Facebook ads manager is for Facebook. So you see, once you come to your TikTok ads manager, you see campaigns, you see tools, you see analytics. So for you to create a TikTok pixel and install it on your website like this, you come to TikTok and you come to tools, come to your TikTok ads manager, you see dashboard campaign tools. Then you come to tools, you click on events, you click on events, you see app event, share event that happens on your app. This is for app install ads, web event, share event that happens on your website. This is where we are going and for offline. So at this point, you click on manage. So once you click on manage, you click, you select create pixel. So once you Click on create pixel, you will see manual setup and partner setup. You click, you select manual setup and you click on next. Then you give your, your pixel a name. Let's say we are giving it forever. You give your pixel a name, you select next. Once you click on next, your pixel is created. So at this point, your pixel is created. It's telling you to create event leads, create custom events, funnel, and all those things. You are not going to do all this at this point. You are not doing all this at this point. You click on, you select skip step. Then you see event API, custom code, and event builder. You select these two and you click on next. So at this point, you have two options. You have event method set up for event API and you see custom code. So all you need to do at this point, you click, you set, you come on that custom code and you click on view instructions. If you see, if you click on view instructions, that is where you see your pixel code. That's where you see your pixel code that you need to install on your website. So the instruction is, Paste the code in the S section of your website and add the code between the tag of every page on your website. So how can you do this? Let me show you a simple step for you to do this. Log in back to your, go to your website. This is the back end of my own website that I want to put this pixel. So I will scroll down and I will come to plugins. I will, I will select add new plugins. Add new plugin. Then you see, you select under add new plugin, under search, you, you click on, you search for HFCM. That's the name of the plugin we, we are going to use to do this. Then you see this plugin, Edda Footer Code Manager by 99Robots. You click on install. Once you select install, you click on activate. Then with that, we have successfully installed the plugin and it is activated. So 
the next thing you need to do is to go back to installed plugins because the, pl the plugin is already installed on our website. Go to installed plugins here. Installed plugins. Then identify the plugin. You see header footer code manager. Click on settings and general page. Then you see your plugin somewhere around here. This is the plugin we just installed. So once you come to this plugin here, you see all snippets add new. So for you to add a new snippet, that is add the pixel code on your website. Once you come under your plugin, this is the plugin you we just installed, HFCN. You click on add new here because we want to add a new code. So using the plugin we just installed. So what you need to do is to click, is to give your snippet code a name. So let's give it TikTok pixel. TikTok pixel. Under snippet type, leave it as HTML. Under site, site display, leave it as site wide because the pixel code has to be on all the pages on your website. So another thing you need to do, you see, you come under location. We are not doing any, anything on that exclude pages, exclude posts. So the instruction is the code should be in the header. So if you come to this instruction, you will see add the code between the tag of every page on your website. Paste the code in the header section of your website. So you come here and leave this as header. The device display, let it show on all devices and the status should be active. Once you do that, you come back to your TikTok pixel and click on copy. Once you click on copy, paste this code on your website and click on save. Once you save it successfully, you come back to your TikTok Ads Manager under this page, come back to this page and click on finish. Then you have successfully installed tick, your TikTok pixel on your website, but you need to verify. We need to verify if this TikTok pixel is working or not. So how can you verify that? You, you, we have a TikTok pixel helper. It's a tool, it's a Chrome extension. TikTok pixel helper. It is a Chrome extension, just like Facebook pixel helper. If you click on it, click on TikTok pixel helper here. I already have it on my laptop. That's what you will do. That's why it's telling me remove from Chrome. I already have it. That's what you do. You install TikTok Pixel Helper and add it on your Chrome browser. So once you add it on your Chrome browser, you go to your website, open your website, and let's verify if the Pixel is working. So can we see now that the Pixel, the TikTok Pixel Helper has been able to identify that one Pixel found, TikTok Pixel Helper, one TikTok found on our website and the name of the pixel is forever so if you come back here you see the name of our pixel is forever and that's how you can install tiktok pixel on your website successfully thank you for watching this video if you are here to subscribe to my youtube channel i will encourage you to do that like this video subscribe to my youtube channel thank you